Yo guys, Code Life here. So in today's video, I'm going to be helping you guys out with an audio issue that's recently popped up in Fortnite for quite a few players, including myself. Now, before I show you guys how to fix this issue, I'll firstly explain what the issue is itself and how it could be affecting you. So what exactly is this Fortnite audio issue? Well, what's happened is there's been a recent Windows 10 update that's caused a number of issues with the audio in Fortnite and many other games. There isn't really one specific audio issue from what I've read so far as everyone's been experiencing different problems with their audio since this Windows 10 update. The most common issues that I know of that you guys may have experienced are number one, load in-game audio, which this specific issue in particular is the one I've been experiencing myself. I did a temporary fix for this yesterday when I first noticed it by just simply turning up my Fortnite audio as it's usually quite low anyway. I was really confused at why this happened until I did realise today that it was that Windows 10 update. But the lowered in-game audio issue isn't the only issue that people have been experiencing. Other more major audio issues are things like distorted audio, muffled audio, echoey audio, tinny audio and even dysfunctional directional audio. That specific issue is where the footsteps of players don't match up to what you're saying, like the sound completely messed up. These issues that I just listed are the more extreme issues, which some of you guys may have been unlucky enough to experience, but not to worry guys, as all of these issues that I've just listed there can be fixed so easily, which I'll now get into right now. So to fix any of these audio issues, what we are going to do is simply remove the update that's caused this issue to happen in the first place. Now before you guys think we're uninstalling a super important Windows 10 update, we're not. Microsoft themselves have even stated that they messed up with this update and they also stated that they are aware of all of these issues that have been happening. Unfortunately though, they are still yet to put out a hotfix to fix all of these issues. Microsoft did also state that they are working on a fix for this and they said that it will be available late September which in my opinion, I personally don't fancy waiting until late September to have my audio issue fixed. And I'm sure that you guys don't want to either. So what we're gonna do is just simply uninstall this update. So to uninstall this Windows update, you want to simply click on your Windows Start button at the bottom left and then click on the little settings cog. After doing that, the Windows Settings tab will appear. In here, you want to choose Update and Security. You want to then click on the third option down, View Update History. This will then show you all of your recent updates that you've installed. The specific update that we're looking for here is the update KB4515384. That's the update that's been causing all of these problems. Also, by the way, I want to quickly mention that if you guys haven't installed this update, you should be good. You shouldn't really be getting any audio issues. If there are any audio issues still and you haven't installed this update, I think it's something else rather than Windows. Back to the update though, guys. Once you have found this update, you want to head to the top and click on uninstall updates. Another window will then appear. You want to then locate the exact same update again. That's update KB4515384. You want to then double click on that update and then click the uninstall button at the top then you want to click yes it does take quite a fair amount of time to do this guys so just be patient don't turn off your pc or anything like that just let it load once it's finished loading you'll then get a box appear asking if you want to restart I do recommend you guys restart your computer, but before you do restart, I would turn off automatic Windows updates if you haven't already. What this will do is it'll prevent the update from popping up again. It really shouldn't though, even if you don't turn off automatic Windows updates, as I've still got automatic Windows updates turned on, and mine didn't reinstall the update, so you guys should be good even if you don't do that. I thought I still would mention it guys, as every PC is different, and this update could pop back up for you, which we don't want until it is fixed. But yeah guys, after after restarting your PC, you should be all good. Now you guys can play Fortnite without experiencing any of those horrible audio issues, as we've now removed the Windows update that was causing all of them to happen in the first place. For me, uninstalling the Windows update fixed my audio. My audio is now back to normal, which I'm super happy about. Hopefully it does the same for you guys and it fixes all the audio issues. If it did guys, be sure to leave a like on the video. And also, if you are new to my channel, please consider subscribing as well. As well as that guys, if you would like to support me, you can do do this by using code CODELIFE in the Fortnite item shop. It really does help me out guys and is very much appreciated. But yeah, I hope to see you all in the next video. Thanks for watching. Peace.